I'm going to bring you through uh, essentially, you know, rough drying your hair and how to blow out your bangs if you have bangs. So anybody who um, has gotten some uh, root kits from me um, probably will have seen me color my roots and that's what I did. I colored my roots and, and now my hair is, is wet and uh, ready to go. So I, I figured it would be a good time for me to show you um, you know, how to blow dry your hair. Don't we look so, <laughs> so pretty, you know, coming out, but, you know, obviously this is what, you know, you would look like, um, you know, at home as well, which is why I didn't, uh, get myself dressed up for the root touch up or this blow dry. Uh, so I'm going to use, um, some, uh, five in one, uh, by J Beverly Hills. Uh, it's my favorite. It has, you know, uh, shine to it. It has heat protectant. It has um, a little bit of hold to it. It's a really great product if you want to use multiple products in your hair, but you don't want to put multiple products in your hair. Um, and I'm going to use some Revive Oil um, because that is um, something that I use, um, especially if you're in the salon with me getting your hair done. You know that I use uh, all the time. Uh, I use it on wet hair and I use it on dry hair. The 5-in-1, I would just use it on um, wet hair, you know, and then whenever you're putting product in your hair, you always want to start at the ends and work your way up. I uh, I tend to get oily roots at some point. Um, I like to do my hair, and then uh, I like to go as long as I can without, you know, having to wash it and dry it. So uh, I put the product in, starting on the ends, working all the way up to the top. I'm now going to. You know, brush my hair out. Make sure that the product is evenly distributed. Um, I used the Root Touch Up kit and uh, I used Fragile Shampoo and Conditioner to wash my hair out. Uh, my hair is longer, it's blonde, um, you know, obviously lightened. Uh, so I like to have a little bit more moisture in my hair than if it was not uh, pre-lightened. So I'm also going to uh, additionally use uh, some lift up in my hair. I uh, I tend to get flatter in my roots um, when my hair is not lightened and obviously it's grown out. We're all <laughs> growing out our hair these days. So I don't really have a lot of body and a lot of movement in through the top so it tends to lay flat or flatter and I feel like uh, today is is a good day to put a little volume in there. So if you notice, it's just habit. Um, I tend to clean out my brush every time um, I use it um, in the salon and at home. You know, just clean out the brush real quick so nothing accumulates in it. And uh, the other thing I do sometimes is I'll put my brushes through the dishwasher, you know, to kind of clean and sanitize them. It's kind of a neat trick. So um, this is the lift up. So you can kind of Take your hair and spray it right on the on the root there. Um, only spray it where you feel like you want some volume. You know, I obviously don't really want them in my bang area. You know, just kind of in the crown and in through the and through the top. Um, I don't really need them. You know, too much in through the sides. Just you know, in this area right here, just so that it doesn't lay flat and I get some volume out of it because uh, I'm going to essentially rough dry my hair so that I can curl it because what I like to do is curl it and then sleep on it and brush it out and put more product in so every day I have something a little bit different. So. I'm going to use my professional blow dryer. Um, I have um, professional tools on my website if you find yourself, you know, playing around and feeling like, you know, you need something better than what you have. Um, I always suggest using a nozzle. A nozzle usually comes with any kind of a blow dryer. And I particularly like these um, little metal grates that just kind of click right on the end of your blow dryer. It helps to, to really blow dry your hair faster and create um, your hair it make it smooth you know it aids in helping to make your hair smooth so whenever I blow dry my hair especially now that I put you know a product in that's gonna help create 
you know, some lift and some volume, which um, I'm not sure if I showed that to you. It's actually what was featured um, in my newsletter. So you're going to um, take your blow dryer and your your nozzle and you're going to just really kind of lift up and just direct the air right up into your root area so that you're, you know, using gravity, you know, to create some volume for yourself. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to kind of go through and just really start my root area and lift the hair up, not really worrying, you know, about my ends too much. All right, here we go. Stop talking to me. <laughs> I'm going to take a break. 